What's going on you guys? My name is Josh, also known as Harry Tornado. A few weeks ago, I went and bought 17 sealed mystery pallets from Goodwill. And here on my channel, we've been going through them one by one, opening them up and seeing if we can find some cool stuff to flip. So far, we've opened three out of the 17 and we found some really cool stuff inside. So today, my wife and I are gonna go through and open up at least one, possibly two more pallets in the same video and see if we can find some cool stuff to flip online. Just in case you guys are new here, or if you don't remember from the last video, I want to break down the total cost of the pallets. There were 17 total, and when we take up the cost of the actual pallets, which was $515, plus the shipping cost, moving the pallets from Goodwill to my warehouse, plus the actual warehouse, this is a terrible drawing of a warehouse, all that together equals $1,140. And so far in the series, we've made a total... Uh, revenue of $318, meaning that we are still $822 away from our break-even point on these pallets. However, here is a list of everything I've sold so far, which gave us that $318 total revenue, but here is the updated list of everything I've sold since the last video. You can see it was a ton of stuff. One fishing lure sold for $8, the flower plate sold for $10, South Carolina decanter sold for $10, Little Big Planet sold for $10, Lego Batman sold for $3, Billy Goat Book sold for $2, Knitting Bag sold for $12, Luminous from PS Vita sold for $7, a lot of three fishing lures sold for $14, a mystery box sold for $30, this was just a bunch of random stuff from the pallets, a toy lot sold for $5, Uncharted PS Vita game sold for $20, a play school barn sold for $5, some spoon fishing lures sold for $8. One of my handcuff cases sold for nine and the other one sold for 10. The Santa music box sold for $25. The church acrylic painting sold for $20. The JFK painting sold locally to a follower on Instagram for 50 bucks. That was pretty interesting. Another mystery box sold for $30. All of the sewing patterns from the last video sold to one buyer for $85 plus shipping. Happy to be moving those out. Another mystery box sold for $27 in profit. Spy Hunter game for PS Vita sold for $8. And the Johnny Applewood Appleseed thing sold for $2, giving us a total of $410 in revenue. Now, we were $822 away from our break-even point, but when we take this 410 out, now we are only $412 away from our break-even point, and we still have 14 pallets left to open. What's going on you guys? Josh here, also known as Harry Tornado. Today I'm outside underneath the tent with my beautiful wife. We're going to go through this smaller pallet right here. There's only two left in our driveway and then we have uh, our storage units filled up with 12 more. So we have 14 more to go through. Uh, like I said, we're going to do this small one first. If this one turns out to be a dud and there's nothing exciting in here, we'll go ahead and do the second one in, the, in today's video as well. So let's go ahead and get into it and see what we can find. All right, let's go ahead and rip this open here this was one of the smaller pallets we bought and this was uh, one of the full price pallets so this pallet was $40 but it shouldn't take us too long to go through it looks like most things are in boxes let's go ahead and dig in first up we got these Sylvania lights I'm assuming they're not burnt out because somebody donated them so I'm gonna scan these and see how much they're selling for coffee pots oh just the just the canisters yeah um, yeah, just put them in one of those boxes over there. That's fun. Here's a set of two that sold for $12.95 plus shipping, and we've got two, four, six, eight. We have nine. So this would be like 40, 50 bucks worth of light bulbs right here on top. Nice. Oh, okay, oh. Drop, dropped one. It's okay, we had nine. So now we have an even number. <laughs> ah. I'll get Anderson over to clean that up. No, <laughs> Spider-Man boogie board. That's the yard sale item. What's that uh, one? Ceramic Santa. Oh no, ceramic. No, no, no. See if it's actually the. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah. Is it a cookie jar? It looks like a musical cookie jar. I don't think it's a cookie jar. Batteries. I don't know. Why would the head come off? I don't know. We'll just put it in the Christmas pile of the yard sale. Here's a couple puzzles. I'm not going to count the pieces. Just going to throw them in. Um, I had a Christmas pile and then it got out of hand. So now we're just going to have a Christmas storage unit. Bag. That's cute. Cute bag. Country Road 
where would this actually land? I was hoping this would actually have the printer inside, but it is filled with greenery. Greenery and fake flowers. More Christmas stuff. Oh, what is that? Photo paper. Canning photo paper. It... Sealed? I don't know. Huh. You can scan this. So there's none sold on eBay and none listed on Amazon. I don't know. This might be worth putting on eBay. Let's make this the eBay box over here. What is that? Halloween stuff? I don't know. Yeah. They look kind of like coasters, but then they have like a little thing on them. Hmm. I don't know. There's a little, little wire shelving units. These, I could probably put these in the garage somewhere. That's a pretty cool lamp. lamp? Yeah. It's like kind of see through, but kind of not. Maybe we can find a shade in there somewhere. That's a really Calphalon. nice pan. Calphalon? Mm -hmm. It's like brand new. It's really nice. Are you going to keep it? <laughs> Always like keeping the good stuff. Uh, so it's probably eBay. Calphalon's a really good pan and that one doesn't even look used. This lamp is really cool. I'm going to set this off to the side. Oh wow. This is cool. It is really cool. It's thick. What does it say? Napa Home and Garden. Napa Home and Garden. Urn with metal handle. Huh. It's pretty cool. Should be a pretty good Facebook Marketplace flip there. So, photo protection and more photo paper slide. Okay. I'm and pretty sure people still use photo paper sometimes. Well. Pretty sure. Put it in the eBay box. Oh, here's another one that's Oh, well, that's a pair of them. Okay, that's even better. This just went from a $20 Facebook Marketplace sale to a $50. Guide Post Magazine from 1964. Publix Cup. Oh, Turvis, Turvis Tumblers. Brand new Turvis Publix Cups. Oh, awesome. There's a bunch of them. I say a bunch. There was two. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> was really Look at all of them. Oh, these are cute. Look at that. Oh, wow. That is cute. That whole set is really cute. Yeah, it's a whole set of them. Wow. Can we keep? Can we keep? <laughs> I think these are popsicle stick makers. Uh, Guideposts, Turvis tumblers are good. Um, possibly, I guess. Oh wait, here we go, yeah. These are cake, is cake pops. These sticks are for cake pops because this is a cake pop. Oh, yeah. mode. I might put that on eBay. This one's so much easier to go through than the last one. Oh my gosh. We're like almost done. Yeah. Oh, that's a set of, is it like? These are like pots. I think they have lids. Yeah, they have lids. That have to look at them when you get them all pulled out. But I think you could like put them on the counter. Mm-hmm. Like, oh, wow. Oh, so yeah, decorative. Do they probably say something about not being food safe? Um, These are yeah, just. Oh, here's a lid. I think this is the lid to the Calphalon pan. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Calphalon essentials. Kitchen essentials from Calphalon. That's probably like an $80 pan at like TJ Maxx. Yeah. Box of kids' toys. Well, let me get this lamp out of here first. This lamp is not... Oh, there's more cups to match the wow. set. Yeah. How are we going to get them out? I don't know. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay. Gentle, so we already broke one thing. Okay. Here, I'll give we you... We already broke one thing. We... <laughs> I didn't do anything. <laughs> oh, man. Why do they put all this heavy stuff at the bottom? All right. Does that side have a... Let's move this box first. Okay. What's in there's, here? There's stuff. Okay. 
Christmas, Christmas stuff. Some toys. Toys, okay. Let's just set this off to the side. I'll go through it in just a second. Oh. You got it? Yeah, I'm strong. I don't want someone the bottom to break out. Okay, this this one's cracked. That one's cracked. But everything else looks right. good. I want it. Okay. That one's chipped and cracked. Aww. But it's the bowls. We need bowls. We do need bowls. I mean, they're not like the best quality. They're cute though. But they are cute. This Tabletops cute. lifestyles, Amelia. All right, just, I like that bowl though. There's only one bowl. Uh, okay, so those are all Haley's personal plates now. <laughs> Maybe not. We'll see. Yeah, this was so quick. This is so quick. Oh my god, this is this is fifteen thousand times easier than the last palette. Toilet paper holder trophies. You go books today? Maybe. Um, Tupperware. Oops, the bag's open. Let's get this out. Kids' toys. Oh, I need to go through that box for. Okay. Postcard book from Norman Rockwell. That's actually pretty cool. It's like postcards that you can like rip out and send to people. Eight bucks, brand new. That'd be that'd be worth putting it up on eBay. It's another boogie board. Yeah, it's not that bad. I'll it's just put, bad. put it in the yard sale pile. These are, toys. These are some pretty good toys. Box of animals. These are perfect yard sale toys. So gotta go through that. Ooh, look, that's that um, Pyrex stuff you used to look Corningware, for. made in USA. That's Corningware, not Pyrex. That's awesome. Wish my arms were longer. Oops. Chuckler. Just basic stuff. For a yard sale, all that. What is this? <laughs> That's actually really clean yeah. to be a Goodwill donation. Usually, stuff like that is greasy oh, no. as all get out. Wait, how do you do this? Oh. Yeah. Magic Chef. Probably yard sale. CD player. Oh, Discman? Something? You get a couple bucks for that at the yard sale. This is a pretty nice pan. Salad Master? I feel like I've seen that before. It's pretty, I mean, it's dirty on the bottom, but it's clean up top. It's like a sauce pan or something. Like, it's, feel how heavy that is. Might keep that. Keep that slash eBay that. Look at those. I don't really know. Uh, I don't know. There's that. I don't know where you put the other stuff. In. This is the lid to the salad master. Let me put them all in there. Or no, this photo pepper's eBay box. Now that the Salad Master has a lid, that probably will be a good eBay item. Yeah. That is a very sturdy pan. Might be enough to pay for the whole pallet. Still gotta go through this box here. Is there toys? Probably needs batteries, but looks like it would work just fine. Christmas. Things remembered engraved gifts. Oops. Reflections. Do you think this is first? Ooh, is this gold? Louise and Paul, 1992. Mm. No pictures. 
I guess I could put it on eBay. But what do you think the chances are that somebody, yeah. Louise and Paul, a couple that were married in 1992, would, <laughs> would use it? I know, I'm so excited today. I'm going too fast. It's okay. Oh, here's another one of those public These symbols. are picture frames. Or not picture frames, like wall. Oh, another public service. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Mm. Little treat food. thing. Some more kids' toys. Shirt. Whole brain teaching for challenging kids. Might be worth something. Toy. Now, what are these? These are like wall wall hangings. These are pretty cool. They are really you cool. make like a whole town on your wall, you yeah. know? And they're like 3D, oh, cool. like all textured and stuff. Yeah, this is awesome. Really cool. Sell us a set. Yep. The Tervises will sell without the lid. With the whole thing though. Oh yeah, with the handle. It's awesome. Yeah, that was good. Just with how it Christmas. I think the rest of that's junk. All right, might as well go ahead and do the second one. All right, guys, so we just finished unloading that first pallet. Forgive my hair. I have my GoPro strapped to my head, and I'm super sweaty even underneath this tent. That was actually a really fun pallet to go through. It wasn't too much work involved like the last one you guys saw. Uh, we were able to clean it out. We only had a few items that went to trash, like not at all. All this is really solid yard sale stuff, um, except the flowers. I don't know if I'm going to put that in the yard sale. Uh, but like I said, just the light bulb should pay for the whole pallet. That was a $40 pallet. Just these two vases on Facebook Marketplace, I should easily be able to get 40 bucks, maybe 50, maybe even 60. I'll probably list them for 60 and accept an offer of 40. Um, but those are really solid. Haley got the whole set of dishes that she's keeping. Um, here's the eBay stuff. We got the Calphalon pan with the lid. We got the Salad Master pan with the lid. All the brand new Tervis cups from Publix. Moe's, Moe's, hey, 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 can it? No. Sorry for the interruption. Moe's would not stop barking at that dog in our neighborhood. But anyway, since we were able to get through that pallet very quickly, like that was maybe like 30 minutes or so, um, and we still have energy and we're not dead for the heat and sweat yet. We're gonna go ahead and go through the last pallet we have in our driveway here. Uh, these, everything in our driveway was $40 pallets. So all the pallets we've unboxed here have been $40. So this is our last $40 one. And then we'll move into the $25 pallets at our storage unit. This box is a little bit bigger than the last box we went through. So there's probably gonna be more stuff, but hopefully it is gonna be just as easy to get through as the first one. So let's go ahead and get into it. Let's dig in. What is it? I don't know. I can't tell. Can you tell? Oh, an air mattress or something? No. Maybe it's one of those shoe organizers. Oh, that's right. Or like awesome. over the door organizers. I don't know. Let's let's see. Oh, it's a bunch of different things. They're just bags. bags or... I don't know. They look like mattress bags or something. Oh, they're not mattress bags. This is how big they are. I don't know. That's weird. Maybe we can shove them full with yard sale stuff so this I don't have to keep different. using my box. This is like, what, covers? This is a garment bag. I think that's just a bunch of random bags that were in a mesh bag. Yeah. I'll just throw them over there. Nice sturdy pot. Is it a brand? No brand. No brand. It's still a yard sale item. It's cute. It is. It's got the drainage pot and everything. Looks homemade too. Yeah. $3.99. Target home bowl. It's a good size bowl. Burger Maker by Shetland. All right. Ooh, what is this? There's like a little flower, hanging flower pot. That's cool. Yeah, this, this is so cute. Yeah. That's kind of gross. Is that a fort? And like two little like teacher mugs. Oh yeah. 
And here's one of those nautical stars. I've always wanted one of those. I almost got this tattooed when I was like 18. I was like, because I was eight, it was 2008, and I was like, oh my gosh, nautical stars are so sick. I want that tattooed so bad. So glad I didn't. Is there a battery in this? No, no battery. There's a gigantic doll. What brand is it? It's Disney. Disney? Yeah. Who is that? I don't know. Is that Jasmine? I'm sure somebody in the video will recognize who she is. It just says it looks like it looks like Jasmine. That's a great yard sale item. Really Some kid comes to the yard sale, they'd love that. Yeah, Jasmine, I thought she wore blue. What is this? It was just a vase, I guess. Oh, this is a cool like hanging light. Oh, a little pendant. I've already installed one light fixture in our house, so I guess I can do it again. Where's the bag with me? This is at the bottom. Yeah, in my hand. Yeah, yeah that's really that's cute. Yeah. It has an, that industrial feel in it, like this opens up. Yeah. I like that. I do too. Let's we'll set that off to the side. It's a cute little jewelry organizer. Is that what that is? Um, Hang, yeah, mm -hmm. jewelry organizer. That's cute. Set of four. Mm -hmm. Lunch bags. Anything that isn't eBay, just put in those boxes. Picture frame, lunch bags. Ooh, what is this? This is like hand painted. Look at this. That's a little canvas. Somebody uh -huh. painted that. There's a drawing of it, or drawing of something. Some lace. There's like paint instructions. That's pretty cool. This is a car radio or something? Ooh. CD receiver? A Kenwood. Huh. Kenwood is good, but that's very new. I don't know why somebody would take that out. And it looks like it was already installed. It makes me think it was probably broken. But I'm not sure. Kenwood model DPX501BT. It's worth like 30 bucks or so, if it works. I don't know if it works. And that just, it looks a little rough. I don't know if I'd want to risk selling that. So we'll see, that's the lid to this box. Oh. Something big. Something George big. Foreman rotisserie. Mm. George Jr. That's what I hate about this stuff is it's just usually so gross. Yeah, nobody cleans them. No, they just give them away. I'm just gonna keep this in the bag. Let's get it out. Oh, it's got some Germax on the side. Kid Spring. Keelan Calm, New Orleans. Pretty interesting. I like it. Jester hat. Lamp. Mm. This is old though, based on that plug. Look at the exposed wires oh, yeah. on that plug. It is an old lamp. bag we can use. Looks like a mail organizer. Huh. Maybe. Oh, it, like it looks blue. broken. Yeah, it's all broken up. Neutral bullet bag, new attacks. What do you want? Uh, I would just toss it. It's broken. This bag's cool. Oh, this is a Jan Sport. Transport hummingbird bag. That's awesome. It's like a maybe a diaper bag or something. I'm not sure. Hmm. It's definitely an eBay item though. A cute sunflower cup. That is cute. Is it a Tervis? Yep. Really? Mm -hmm. That's awesome. Let's 
Starbucks. Pretty worn, but Ooh, black, Starbucks. black Starbucks mug. Just got some paint chipping. Oh, it's a little... Oh, nope. Just kidding. Nothing in there. Contigo. That's pretty cool. And health meter scale. Okay. This is just empty. Let's see. Nothing else. Okay. If the Starbucks was in better condition, I'd probably eBay it. But... We need to cut some sides. I'm too short. Yeah. The silicone bakeware molds. So you could use this to bake stuff, or people could use it to make flower shaped soaps. People use these for soaps. Oh. I learned that from Yvette. Shout out to Yvette, oh. lady I used to work with. And if you're watching this video, I miss oh. you so much. We got this is like a light up thing, I guess. Ooh, it's like a spooky Halloween door. Oh, it's a drill. Yeah, I think there's a sander too. Man, that is ancient. Black and Decker U300 commercial roller bearing drill. That's awesome. Oh, yeah, it's an angle grinder. That's what I used to fix the tent with. Oh, there's a tray on it. A what? Oh, there's a, looks like a table saw. Well, not a table saw. Skill saw. Yeah. Yeah, that That's is, pretty cool. Yeah. Hand strap trailer wrench. Can you put a side for me? Um, yeah. What's this? Oh, toys. Plushes. Broadway bear. Oh, it's a little Star Wars guy. My Little Pony. This is... These are, these are like... This could be good. What is this? Over the moon? What is it? Let's try me. doesn't do anything. That's the fish. Is this Little Mermaid? Baby blanket. That's cute. Mm -hmm. Alright, we gotta go through this bag of toys. Man, it seems heavy. He's over here. Is this like a Car seat cover or something? I think it's a car seat cover, yeah. It looks looks new. Well, I don't know, it looks pretty new. I can sell it on eBay. I know you can't sell used car seats, but maybe you can sell used car seat covers. It's a cracker barrel, cast iron pan. Oh wow. Like, like from cracker barrel. That's probably a good eBay item. It's a flat. Definitely need a can of that. It's my little booster seat. Yard sale. I'm gonna take this picture out. At least I thought it would. Oh, there's the other lamp. It's a pair of lamps. Lingerie bag. Lingerie? Lingerie. Lingerie bag. Yard sale. Here's a, one of the shoe organizers. Like oh, yeah. I, I could probably use that in my eBay. Just throw it over there for now, though. You don't want it separate? No. I'm gonna have to go through everything again later. Ooh, what is this? What is Willow. this? Lamp? Willow tree. This pot. Oh. I'll get, I'll get it. Duck I'll get oven. It. I'll get it. I got it. Okay. What is this? This is four and a half ounce. I was hoping it was like a Griswold or something. That's still really cool with the lid. That's old. That is an old pot. Yeah, Willow tree. It's a Willow tree in the, in the packaging. It's like new, newborn baby. That's awesome. That's probably one of the more popular ones. Was it just one? I thought I saw two. I don't know. This is the only one I see right now. Okay. That's definitely eBay. And I think I'm going to eBay this pot too. 
I'm really bad at taking these things out and not gonna need to go back in. The stuff with the phone. Oh wait. wait. Okay, what do you where are you putting eBay stuff? Uh in that box over there in the corner. <laughs> I need to cut my side too. Oh, that's nice. What? What is that? Dewalt? I don't see anything. No brand. That's still nice. Let's see if it works. Ha! Man, that thing is hot. Like instantly hot. It works. Sweet. So cool. Bag of jewelry. Bag of jewelry. Mm -hmm. We can line it up with the other jewelry that I still I have from the first lot. I think there's some more down here. Too, maybe. Well, just one piece. What's that remote right there? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know what that is. Unbranded. Where you want this? Uh, jewelry. Put it in the eBay box over there. Two nautical stars. Oh, this planners, is a TV. I kind of like this one, this distressed one. Uh huh. There's a TV right there, but I can't get it out. Oh, I was saying that earlier. I didn't know if it was a computer monitor or the TV. <sighs> Something. I really packed it in here. Oh, well, that's a cute little flatware box. This is cute. I think it's like one of those, like, maybe jewelry. a jewelry thing, but it yeah. looks like a piece of furniture. Yeah. A little mini piece of furniture. I think it's missing a door or something here. Maybe. It's out. Face Cute. Facebook Marketplace all day long. Ten bucks. It's a Dell. Oh, it's not a TV. It's a computer monitor, and it's cracked on the top. Is it a HDMI? It does have an HDMI output, but it is cracked. If it works, I could probably sell it on Facebook Marketplace, but I need to need to find the power cord. Gotta find the power cord. Salt and pepper shakers that kind of look like coffee mugs. Yeah, oh. kind of, not really. Yeah, those are cute. It's a blood pressure cuff thing. Here's a, pot. here's a phone. With... I just, we had like four or five coffee pots at the yard sale. And nobody bought any of them. No. We even put them out for free and nobody got them. I just, it's, you can get a brand new coffee pot for like 15 bucks at Walmart. Like why would you get a used one at the yard sale? We oh, the jackpot with little planners today. Yeah, baseball bat. That won't be a good one. Nope. Worth copperhead. Toilet paper, cheapy. Oh, I think this is a set of cooking campware stuff. Cook, I can't talk. Just slide this over, yeah. Oh, we have to loosen up a little bit. Yeah, a little oh, camping yeah. set. A little pot, pan. That's cool. Watching back the videos while I'm editing, I realize that I say, that's pretty cool. After oh, wow. like 95% of the items. The same with when people do things for you, you say, thank you. Whoever. I really appreciate that. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Synonyms and antonyms. Got a calculator here. That's because they threw this skill saw on top. Ugh. And that that brush thing has something sticky on it. Well, what about a BMW or BMW? BMW, yeah. That's cool. CDs. Are they all CDs? I think so. No. Okay. There might be video games in here. Beverly Croft. I don't know. I'll have to go through those. This candle. Darcy and David's. It smells like cozy vanilla. What is that? Knives. Oh wow. 
Mer Merico? Just keep them. Let me look them up real fast. Hmm. It's pretty expensive. M E Y E R C O. I'm not seeing any sold. Maybe I'll turn off solds and. Yeah, I'm not seeing. There's Mayorco knives, but not like steak knives. They're like pocket knives. Oh. So I don't know. Definitely worth something. I mean, some of them are in better condition than others. Yeah. Actually, maybe that's just dirt. Yeah. Manufactured in China, headquarters in USA. That's pretty cool. I mean, we got four of the, uh, this looks like maybe a cherry or something. And then four of the other ones. That's cool. I mean, they come in a nice case, so they might be worth something. Is that? I think it's a blood pressure thing. Or not a, a blood sugar thing. I was hoping we'd have two Sony, two of these Sony speakers. But what is this? That's a corn, uh, like you put cornbread mix in it, and it makes cornbread oh, that looks like really corn. Pretty. Yeah, it's cast iron. They sell all the time. I, like, I find them at the bins, but I don't buy them because they're not worth it. Because they're like at the bins, it'd be like five or six bucks um, to buy, you know. But getting it for free in a pallet, that's worth it. So just one Sony speaker, SSH. One five zero zero. Does this, does this Nerf gun work? Oh wow, oh <laughs> that works really well. Yeah, we got a carnival, carnival something. How far have we got? Oh, I think this is the base to that haunted house thing. Yeah, yeah, it goes in the back like that. All right, yeah, everything else looks not, you know, not worth it. That was pretty good. Not too bad. Got a lot of good stuff. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Again, if you saw anything that you would like to buy personally, feel free to shoot me an email. My contact information is in the description of the video. I'll be sure to give you a good deal. Thank you guys so much for watching. You're the best, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.